Welcome back to Tiny Blue Games. My name's, of course, Seesaw or Chris, and today we are talking about Final Fantasy XIV in 2020. Today we are finally taking a look at the Heavensward trailer. Um, I've been super excited to watch this as I've been working through uh, the Realm Reborn story up to now. If you didn't catch yesterday's video, I did a reaction video um, where we watch all of the cutscenes starting at the start of the Parting Glass quest, going all the way to the end of the Realm Reborn story. Um, and today we are diving into the Heavensward trailer. This is my first time watching through the whole trailer. Um, I believe at some point in my life I saw the first 10 seconds where he's kind of walking in the snow, uh, but as someone who hasn't ever played Played Final Fantasy XIV until I guess this last year. I, I never had any reason to watch the full thing, so here we go. Uh, but yeah, let's get started. Um, so there are spoilers in here if you're someone who is new to Final Fantasy XIV. Just be aware of that. So delivered from destruction by the Warriors of Light, that's us. However, things really fell apart at the end <laughs> of uh, the Realm Reborn story for us. Fate has cast down these heroes, and their light now threatens to fade. It's true, a lot of people are sad. Oh, see, this, this is the part I remember watching as a kid. Um, so beautiful. I think as a kid it really reminded me of the Wrath of the Lich King trailer too, which I was a huge fan of, so that's why I ended up watching this small chunk at some point. Oh, so cool. I love the music in the background too. Just epic. There's the player character, the Warrior of Light. Oh, the cup. So yeah, we saw poor Nanamo. Um, I'm still not entirely sure if she's dead or not. Like, we haven't had anyone, except for the people who are trying to set us up, say that she's dead. But yeah, it doesn't look good. Oh, who... Oh yeah, so he lost his arm, unfortunately. <laughs> and they, we do have the blood in the trailer, which I was commenting on in the cutscenes. Yeah, so that's all the bad stuff that happened to us in the last parts of the story. Oh, so cool. I love the weapon just wrapped in cloth. What an epic, epic entrance. So this must be us arriving. Oh man, we got dragons. Oh, burns everything off, of course. Oh, is this the bridge? Like, the, the Steps of Fate? What? Oh, it's a Lancer! How cool is that? Ugh, oh, what an epic shot. Yeah, it's gonna be real hard not to make a Lancer while I go through this expansion. <laughs> It's gonna be it's gonna be my struggle for sure. So cool. Oh uh, the these are Ishgard Knights. The is this the the tower? Is this the, the castle? Oh, I've got literal chills right now. Oh, it is. It's the castle. Wow, that's huge! That's absolutely massive! Oh, we got a... Oh, is there... Is there gonna be islands in the sky as well? Is that like... Well, I know flying, I think, comes in this, so... That kind of makes sense, that there would maybe be floating islands, I guess? Oh, I love it! Oh, Sid in his ship! Of course, you gotta have Sid in his ship! What kind of troubles are you gonna get into? Oh man, what are these? Now, because I don't know, like, so we have 
a few different enemies. We've got lots of enemies, let's be honest here. <laughs> There's a lot of enemies we have, so I don't know who the main enemy is of the Heavensward expansion. Oh, look at him. Yeah, he's mad. Okay, so yeah, these are dragons. With, like, Ice Heart, probably. Oh, what an epic fight. And we've just got someone walking up towards to fight them. Yeah, just a Lancer, like, getting geared up. Wow. Oh, and that's, that's our player character, right? That's the... yeah. Yeah, I'm <laughs> gonna probably need to be a uh, Lancer at some point. So cool. Just absolutely epic. Alright, so we just watched the actual cinematic trailer, which was super cool. I think one of the best parts about the trailers for Final Fantasy XIV, um, and any real good trailer has this, is they have pacing, right? So they have their high moments and they have their low moments. I think if a trailer is just raw intensity the entire time, it gets boring. Um, but for instance, so we had the very quiet entrance, and then it got really loud when the first dragon came and sort of revealed to us um, where we were, and then it got quiet again um, when we looked out the window and we're just kind of in awe for a little bit, and then it got back to intensity when we kind of had the, uh, the main enemies coming into the picture, which is really cool. So I think they do a really good job of that, that flow of up and down in terms of your emotions, and I definitely felt like some chills throughout that, so really, really well done. Uh, right now we're going to watch the launch trailer, which I think is more of an information piece, um, but we'll see. So let's start. In the distant past, King Thorden and his knights twelve fought and defeated Nidhogg. So we're learning about, I guess, dragons, maybe? For seven days and seven nights, a bitter battle raged, at the close of which Thordon and half his knights lay dead. Thordon, I think he's the king, or one of us, one of the kings of Ishgard? I could be super wrong. Yeah, that guy. <laughs> that guy. ...the root of an evil that has blighted us for a thousand years. I like the singing once again. So, cast down by fate, us. Oh, so, yeah, there's us with Elphinode and Taturu. I love, I love how she's like protecting her little face from the snow, so cute! So it's us arriving um, in the city. There's Iceheart. Wait, were we with her? Sid and his crew. So are we going to be, like, on the same side so of Iceheart? Is that how this goes? Are coming. It shall be my penance to bear a knight's arms until death grants me leave to retire. When that day comes, no prince shall perish. Ugh. The of dragons. They're really selling the Lancer for me. Oh, so we get some dungeons here. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, wow. Yeah, they really turned it up here. Oh, it looks so cool, those flooded islands. I'm so excited for them. That bear looks terrifying. Oh my god, what's that? All right. Yeah, I'm pretty scared of whoever this is. Is that like a, a trial boss or a raid boss? Because, yeah, that looks terrifying. I love the armor. Oh, these are the... Um, yeah, these guys are other people who want to kill us. <laughs> There's a nice list of people who want to kill us. Wow, what is that? It's like a, a sky whale? Super, super cool. 
Are we on? Like, what are we on? It looks like we are fighting on the back of something. Rise, brave heroes. Maybe they're waiting for a fitting moment to break the news, or may have they know of some other reason. Okay, so the grand companies are working together. Hearken to me, O oh great ones. Give yourselves to the life stream, a drifting soul to find. Well, that's good. So we still have some friends. Oh, what's this? Our crystals are back. You so. Because we lost our protection from Hydaelyn. Spare us the hyperbole. It is not for praise that we fight. Ah, oh. <laughs> the skills are so cool. Oh, we get to see some of like all of the jobs. Oh. Man, it's so cool. They've really, really added a lot to the job, like, skill effects. Oh, the Crystal's Call, so Hydland's gonna be a big part of this, hey? What is that? The coming battle is a chance to excise the root of this conflict, and by my hand, it oh shall be Oh my god. Down. What do you know? Those harbingers of chaos and strife. Oh, the Asians are they? So they are going to be involved in this. Let us show yep. these mortals the true power of the Echo. Oh, they're going to use the Echo. I am become you, and we are become one. Are they going to finish their summon? Oh, that's so many stories. This was really good for like a story point of view. Hydaelyn's champion has grown too strong. Equilibrium must needs be restored. Ah. The time has come for you and yours to join the fray. So cool. Warrior of darkness. I love it. Like, just cool in a complete different way, and I absolutely love it. All right, so here's the last uh, video I want to watch. It's called The Dragon Song, um, and it was recommended to me as well as one of the videos I should watch to get uh, excited for this. So let's see what we have. Oh, I'll move my mouse down. Did I have my mouse in the video for all the other ones? I'm sorry if I did. Oh, is this so? This is the main theme of Heaven's Word. Super cool. Okay, so it's kind of a recap video. We get to. I don't know how many times I've seen her drink this poison now, but it's starting to to upset me. <laughs> <laughs> the amount of times I've seen her crumple down. Yeah, I don't like him. Ugh, that did not go well. I really do enjoy this song, it's really nice. I think, like, one of. For someone who plays a lot of other MMOs. Final Fantasy really brings lyrics into their their music for the game, and it's at first something that's different and you have to get used to, but it really does add something to the mood that can be set with the song. Oh, did they sacrifice themselves? Are they alive? I need to know, because <laughs> that was so sad. We lost so many like of our scions. I mean, the song would have us believe that they sacrificed themselves, so... Here we are arriving again. So this is us coming into the, uh, the town, right? Not, not very welcome, are we? Yeah, we're definitely kind of the outsiders here.
All right, someone's here, the greatest least. There's, so this must be the uh, Warrior of Light. It's always interesting because it's, you know, they look different depending on who's playing, right? But I, they kind of use, I guess, the same-ish look for trailers. Okay, so yeah, we have some people who are on our side still, which is nice. I like that mustache. Okay, that, so this is Iceheart, right? I'm interested to see what role she plays. Okay, so this is the king. Yeah, so this is the king we saw in the last trailer. It's kind of, it's fun seeing, like, the actual in-game models. So some dragons. Wow, that looks, I don't even know what that is. Like, is that a dragon? Yeah, it must be, or like, Wow, that's a crazy creature. Yeah, it's a dragon, right? I don't know what to think about it. I love the armor sets. Like, I hope we get access to a lot of this armor. Is this Sid? Yeah, Sid in his ship. So yeah, we're definitely fighting in this new area with a few opposing forces. Oh. Super cool. Oh, and so there's Hydlin, the big crystal. I love it. So obviously there's still more to do with that story, um, which we did see kind of at the end of the um, more political side of things, which is cool. Um, I wonder if we get our blessing back. Very, very cool. All right, so there's three different videos three completely different styles of like a trailer um, and each of them has got me really excited in different ways so I, I think it was really good of people to suggest I watch the three of them I think they were great I am super excited to dive into this um, yeah I, I can't wait to get on my journey into heaven's word but thank you everyone thanks for watching hopefully you enjoyed this video um, if you could subscribe if you've not subscribed already like comment I do appreciate all of that um, and I look forward to bringing all of you along on this journey into this expansion but yeah thanks for watching I'll see you in the next video